There's evidence of wine production dating back to 6000 BC in Georgia, a transcontinental country. And during the Roman Empire, the craft expanded fast to the rest of Europe. The process of making wine, which involves crushing grapes and allowing them to ferment over time, is incredibly straightforward. Even so, wine remains one of the most refined and esteemed alcoholic drinks. Today's video shows us the world's top 10 most expensive wines. And if you're a wine enthusiast, you'd stay for our top 1 because you simply wouldn't believe it. But before we get to our video, click the subscribe button if you still haven't. Don't forget to click the notification bell as well, so you're always notified whenever we have a new video. So, let's get right to it. Top 10. Chateau Lafitte, 1787. $156,450 Thomas Jefferson, the principal author of the Declaration of Independence and America's third president, was an avid wine drinker. During his tenure as France's ambassador, he purchased coveted bottles of Bordeaux and Burgundy. Occasionally, a bottle purporting to be a part of his collection would turn up for sale, like this mysterious red uncovered behind a cellar wall in Paris. The Chateau Lafitte, which fetched an impressive $156,450 at a Christie's auction, was showcased at the Forbes Gallery after Malcolm Forbes bought it in 1985. But as fate would have it, the cork, already slightly misaligned, was dried out by the lighting. So it slipped, making the wine completely worthless. However, the questions about its authenticity persist to this day. In fact, the best seller, The Billionaire's Vinegar, The Mystery of the World's Most Expensive Bottle of Wine by Benjamin Wallace looked into the Jefferson bottle story. Top 9. Penfolds Block 42 Kalimna Cabernet Sauvignon 2004 Ampule $168,000 France and Italy come to mind when it comes to wine. But the ninth on our list comes from Adelaide, located in southern Australia. And if you're familiar with Adelaide, you'd know it is home to the renowned winery Penfolds. Wine is not the highlight of the Block 42 Kalimnas Cabernet Sauvignon Ampule 2004 because the vintners focused on the elegant presentation of the drink instead. The wine is contained in an ampule developed by Andrew Bartlett, a cabinet artisan. Nick Mount, a glass sculpture. Ray Leak, a glass blower. And Hendrik Forster, a metal artisan. Only 12 bottles were made, making this $168,000 wine among the rarest in the world. The ampule bottle has neither a seal nor a cork, so it's recommended to have a senior member of the winemaking team help with opening the bottle, because doing so requires breaking off the end of a little piece of wood. The Cabernet Sauvignon is a spectacular display of winemaking science, luxury, and art. The wine has blackcurrant flavors, licorice, and dark chocolate. Top 8. Chateau Margot 2009 Balthazar $195,000 Located in Bordeaux, France, Chateau Margot or La Mothe de Margot is among the most renowned and esteemed wineries worldwide. The estate has been around since the 12th century but winemaking might have started in the 15th century. Today, they are still renowned for their sophisticated winemaking techniques. It's considered a tribute to their heritage and richness to have young wine sold at a whopping $195,000. There are only six bottles of the Chateau Margot 2009 Balthazar. The 12-liter bottles are enclosed in an oak box designed to resemble the oak barrels deep within the winery cellars. The hand-engraved gold characters on the label are the work of goldsmiths. Half of the six bottles of this Bordeaux have already been sold at the Le Clos flagship store in Dubai. So, if you have the cash to purchase a bottle, you'll taste coffee, nuts, and black fruit. Top 7. Chateau Margot, 1787. $225,000. At the seventh spot is another Chateau Margot creation. The Chateau Margot 1787, priced at 
The wine was another Thomas Jefferson collection, and William Sokolin, a wine dealer from New York, became the owner of the coveted Chateau Margaux, 1787, in 1989. At the Four Seasons Manhattan, Mr. Sokolin hosted a special dinner to commemorate the bottle's arrival in New York. The wine was on display when a waiter tripped and completely broke it. Thankfully, the wine had insurance. However, the insurance company valued it at $225,000 instead of Sokolin's estimated $500,000 value. The dismayed owner had to put the broken and empty bottle up for auction, starting the bid at $30,000. It was ultimately only sold for $100 after a dismal round of betting, with the proceeds going to charity. Top 6. Chateau Lafitte Rothschild, 1869, $233,000 Next is another Chateau Lafitte on the list. The vintage Chateau Lafitte Rothschild 1869 was created under the Rothschild management, and it was the first wine bottled at Lafitte. In 2019, Sotheby's Hong Kong offered three bottles of this elusive wine for auction. The auctioneers had no idea how well-known the 1869 were in Asia, where owning one is equivalent to being aristocratic. Prices were anticipated to be between $60,000 to $80,000. However, one unidentified collector paid $690,000 for all three bottles. And since the wine is super rare, we can't be sure what it tastes like. But it's supposed to have a cherry flavor, roquefort, and dry finish. We're on the next half of our list. Have you subscribed to the channel? Don't forget to do so by clicking the red button. Click the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever we release a new video. Top 5. Shipwreck Hide Seek 1907 $275,000 a Swedish vessel crossed the Baltic Sea to Russia in 1916. She was transporting wine, including a 1907 champagne, and rumors say that the wine was intended for the Russian Tsar. During the height of the World War I, a German submarine fired a torpedo at the unfortunate vessel. So, the ship in the barrels of cognac, champagne, and wine sat at the bottom of the sea for 80 years in complete darkness. But when a Swedish salvage team discovered the ship in 1997, they recovered its cargo, salvaging 2,000 bottles. The extraordinary discovery led to one bottle costing $275,000. And taste tests were conducted on multiple bottles. Some tasted like Matua champagne with notes of toast and toasted nuts, while another bottle, which most likely had seaweed seepage, tasted of French onion soup and oyster. Top 4. Chateau Cheval Blanc Saint Emilion, 1947, $304,375. One of the most well-known vineyards in the world, Chateau Cheval Blanc, was awarded the prestigious Top Grand Cru class in 2012. And the 1947 Bordeaux is regarded as the best produced. Even wine critic Robert Parker gave it a rating review. The Chateau's grapes were roasted, and many turned to raisins in 1947 because of the intense heat. However, Cheval Blanc went above and beyond to keep what they had. They modified some of their procedures and incorporated ice to create a few vats of priceless wine. The 6-liter bottle of this distinctive Bordeaux brought $304,375 at a Christie's auction to a private collector. The auctioneers predicted it would only sell for about $150,000. Top 3. Chateau Mouton Rothschild, Jeroboam, 1945, $310,700. Aside from being rich, the Rothschilds are known to offer exquisite wines, and their Chateau Mouton Rothschild Jeroboam 1945 is among the most expensive vino ever sold at $310,700. The flavor features a taste of Asian spices, coffee, tobacco, and black fruits. The Rothschilds wanted to honor the Allies' success, so they employed a young French illustrator named Philippe Julien to design the label of their new wine. Julian designed the label with Annie de la Victoire, 
with a V for victory as Winston Churchill inspired it. This started a custom at the Chateau where emerging artists create the labels for each new wine. And instead of receiving payment in cash, they are given 10 cases of the premium wine. Top 2. Screaming Eagle Cabernet Sauvignon 1992 $500,000 Made in 1986 in Oakville, California, Roaring Eagle enjoys a reputation among affluent wine connoisseurs. Robert Parker gave them an almost flawless rating, making them famous for their modest but superb yearly productions. Their 1995 limited release of their 1992 Cabernet Sauvignon was one of the most expensive wines ever created at $500,000. Screaming Eagle provided a 6-liter bottle for their 2000 Napa Valley charity auction and David Lee, a billionaire, won with an offer of half a million dollars. Get in line if you want to purchase wine from the renowned California winery because it may take 12 years to get your order or be included in the waitlist. The Screaming Eagle Cabernet Sauvignon 2009 boasts a purple hue with a cassis fruit oak cream, and jammy black currant flavors. Top 1. Domaine de la Romani Conti, 1945. $558,000. If you want to drink the most remarkable vino, it may just be the Romanti Conti, 1945, the rarest of the rare wines in the world. And it sits at the top spot with a price tag of $558,000. Romani Conti, popular known as DRC, is a famous vineyard in Burgundy, France, and its production technique is shrouded in mystery. They are well known for having the best Burgundies and are so prominent that they attract criminals. One person threatened to ruin the priceless fields unless he was paid 1 million euros. The authorities took it seriously given the importance of the winery and caught the extortionist. Shortly after the end of World War II, the renowned Roman C. Conti vines were wiped out by the vineyard pest Phylloxera. Only 600 bottles were produced during the time, and only after a few years could the vineyard make wine again. The 1945 vino is said to be the unicorn of wine. That's it for our top 10 most expensive wines in the world. See you in our next video, and always remember Invictus Luxury, for people who want more.